Hey, it's Corpsey. Well, we are back at Shriekfest for the 17th annual Shriekfest Horror Film Festival. Another amazing year. The show's run by Denise Gossett, who is amazing. And this is really the best festival, I think, in the country. Get ready to shriek at Shriekfest. You're 17. Crazy, huh? Where did the time go? I started when I was 10, you know. (laughs) Thank you for stealing my joke. I really appreciate it. More people are getting into making movies. The quality just keeps going up, 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 up. I really meant the alcohol. There's a lot of booze at the show. And there wasn't a full bar before, but now there's uh, there's Fireball. I mean, you have wines and, you know, it's not about necessarily the films for me. Hey, give me a couple of cocktails, we'll be good to right, go. Right? Exactly. That's what we need, a yes. little bit of booze. Yes. And I've always said that this is the most non-political festival in the country. So I had a film that I made called Cynthia. It was so amazing that it did not get into Shriekfest. That's right. They're so strict here that being a sponsor, giving the money, giving away the award for best film does not guarantee you acceptance into Shriekfest. That's the kind of festival it is. No amount of money that I I did offer you made a difference. (laughs) The trips, the clothing and the heels, they didn't do do anything. Your film just aired? Yeah, it was one of the shorts, uh, The Things They Left Behind. I really enjoyed The Things They Left Behind. That ending was... That's that that, st- that stays with you. Um, it's based on a Stephen King short story. Oh, the dollar! You paid yeah, the dollar. Yeah, I got. Used to be fifty that. cents, by the way. It used to be fifty cents. Yeah. Man, inflation. It's okay though. I'm okay. so grateful. I'm gonna explain this quickly. Uh, uh, Stephen King made a deal that you can use any of his material for a independent movie, low budget, for a dollar. You adapt the story and you have his name attached, which is great because you have all this huge amount of fans and it gives you yeah. eyes and when you make a project you want people to see it so it's great to have people actually see it and appreciate it and have you reached out to mr king um i know he's seen it but oh uh, he has yeah, I, how uh, do you know that um apparently it got sent to him quite recently so i'm looking forward to knowing uh what he thinks and i hope he likes it so i understand that there were a lot of tears in the audience when this aired <laughs> yeah. uh so it's not really a horror movie how would you describe it the genre psychological horror yeah. Catharsis would have been a good name. Yeah, it really would have been. Are you going to see if Stephen King will make a feature film with you? That's kind of what they, the producers the were aiming for, but I'm trying to do a feature right now. Um, What's it called? It's called Self-Deprecation, and uh, it's about a... I, I heard self-defecation. It's oh, self- that would be great. Yeah, that'd be a whole... Uh, that'd be scary. Hi, Mr. King. They loved her like movie it. and loved Thank your you script. So I'm the director of Good Morning... Good Morning followed up uh, a film that was very emotional about 9-11. Based on a Stephen King novel. I just sank in my seat, just thinking, how am I going to ever follow this? And fortunately, we kept it short enough. I think we fooled everybody to think it was at least somewhat entertaining. Nobody stormed out, so I feel like that was okay. The Street Fest Bloody Reel for the Best Sci-Fi Short Film Award is The Things They Left Behind, directed by Sarah My film won, and I forgot my name was, so I got called up, and I had no idea, and uh, it took me a minute, and thank you guys for liking it. I'm going back to Philly a winner. So my name's Judson Vaughan, and the movie was called Burn. It's a short psychological horror thriller. You've got this father that's recording these, these messages, these videos for his unborn son, and all is not well with the world. And the Shriekfest bloody reel for the best horror short film goes to Burn, directed by Judson Vaughan. <laughs> Thank you to the 17th Street Fest for this amazing award. It was just, it was an honour to be a finalist. Um, and then I found out we got nominated for Best Film. Um, I, I certainly didn't expect to, to get nominated, never mind win something. We're here with the filmmakers from the next movie. What are we about to see? It's called Gnaw. We've always loved Street Fest and Denise, and we had a film here years ago, and we're back, so we're happy. So how did you get the money together for this? Who'd you, who'd you rob? He ran away. The producer yeah, was none of them. That means we don't like to reveal our sources. <laughs> Hi. I want to be in movies. <laughs> I think you... To be here. Have you heard of Gnaw? No. <laughs> what is it? I told Haler I would write a Gnaw theme song. And Can you sing a little? What would the song be? And I, I have a whole album of music inspired by the motion picture Gnaw <laughs> that I'm not releasing. How many Santa movies have you been in? How many what? Santa. Santa. Uh, I think one, I think. Santa yes, Monica. I just threw the elf. We are here for the West Coast premiere of Gnaw. Yeah. We have Miss Sally Kirkland out here. Woo. 
Uh, it was a perfect thriller. It kept us on the edge of our seats. It was awesome. Uh, at this time, I'd like to have Robert Corpsey Ryan, publisher and editor of Girls and Corpses magazine, come up. Yeah. Robert. The Shriekfest Bloody Reel for the Best Horror Feature Film Award goes to No. Yeah. Yeah. Directed by Hayley Garcia. Come on up and get your award. That's all I want to say. Thank you. We won Best Horror Feature for Gnaw. It was awesome. I was one of the writers, and we knocked them dead. And all the cast and crew want to thank Shriekfest for taking home this award. We are so happy. We are so honored. Thank you, Shriekfest. Thanks, Denise. I'm so proud of us, yes. of our team. There you go. So proud. Yay, Shriekfest. Thank, thank you. you. And thanks, Shriekfest. I mean, yes, definitely. it's fantastically freakish. Yes. Thank you, Shriekfest! Stay tuned for more... No, it's over. Ah, goodbye. <laughs>